Shiseido is a Japanese brand. Everybody goes to Japan marvels at how you can have so much technology. Yeah. Be the most advanced country in the world, but still be so human and sensitive. Yeah. Bowing down to people, are extremely polite. Have you been to Japan? If you haven't, oh. will you go now? I'm dying to go to Japan. It's <laughs> not cherry funny. Blossom season. It's not funny. I really hope through Shiseido, I actually make a tour. And uh, would love to experience the country. It's it's. Uh, I've heard so much about it. It's so different than ours, but I feel like culturally, still certain things feel similar. Family values or having you know like very close knit family associations is what I hear. Even the Japanese have. They all lived in the 90s, hundreds. You know, they, they seem to have drinking from the fountain of youth. <laughs> is there a travel destination that you went to that you went and said, "Wow, I mean, now you want to go to Japan? Somewhere you've been to?" Actually. I feel like I want to really explore my own country a little bit more. I think I haven't done that because with shoot I went to a lot of the south part of India, but I want to explore a lot more of the north part of India. I would love to. Like, have you been to Himachal, Uttarakhand, those areas? I haven't. So I would uh, love to do that. Like, do a Kasol and Kasoli and things. Do a like north that. trip. I haven't done that, which is strange because I've travelled all my life. Yeah. But I haven't because some of work never took me there, and I never took enough breaks. You went to Switzerland recently, or was that a while ago? It was last year. Yeah. How was that? Nice. Great. It's always good to travel, see new places. Switzerland, here I have shot so much there. It was like Mehboob Studio you know, at some point. <laughs> so, so well said. How do you think the launch of a dedicated Shishedo website will impact accessibility for consumers? I think today a lot of people are online shopping, and it's great. I think it's a necessity. And uh, Shishedo has such a legacy, and people know that they've been around for such a long time, and they've always delivered the best. So they already have a very, again, a very, very strong base of consumers that have already existed. And the ones who haven't and still want to shop and don't want to go out and purchase it from some physical place can always purchase it online. So I think it's useful actually. What's your favorite current fashion trend? What are you into right now? I don't think I've been a trends person. I think I've always been somebody who channeled my mind frame at that point of time. I think right now my mind frame is comfort over everything, and also kind of just channeling um, myself the way I feel is doesn't kind of force me to become anybody else, and I get to feel like myself. I think that's where I'm naturally gravitating towards. So no trends excite me to me. But even eco-friendly clothing is something you're. You are conscious of. I mean, sustainability is something we are going to have to, whether we like it or not. We should make it a part of our lives because that is the future, and actually, the future is now. <laughs> so, and I feel like, to be honest, India has always been a sustainable country. We always had this thing. Kulad wali chai. And then, we, 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 So I love it. I love. I give. I give away all my things because they are very happy to enjoy designer wear, and I'm very happy to uh, you know share it with my my own loved ones. Would you say Bubbly Bouncer was the turning point in your career, or one of the turning points? It was definitely a start to a new me. I think people also started to look at me as oh you know I think there was a very South Indian like there was a tag where it was like oh she only does South Indian films, but I think the moment I played a Haryanvi. It just didn't get more north than that, so I think it was a way to show people that this is very north Indian. Is there a film that got you really emotional, a role that you did in Telugu or Tamil or Hindi that got you really emotional? I think Aruna Manai recently was, uh, you know, a Tamil film that you know did really really well. It did hundred crores. It's a, it's a Tamil film that yeah. was just, you know, made that kind of money. It's a horror thriller which kids are loving surprisingly. Yeah. You know, the beauty is that it's just a Tamil film that's made that much worldwide. Yeah. It's not. A, it's not even many languages. Which is wow. language, yeah. so it says something about uh, what it did, and it had a. I played a mother in that. I played a mother for the first time, and I think it was something that I really. I think I gave a piece of myself. Yeah. What is an accessory you can never leave home without? Phone, I guess. You know, we all have to carry our phone. But otherwise, are you a watch person? You look at, at your phone for the. I'm actually a skincare person. I am that person. Like my assistant is. He's he's <laughs> actually fed up on me because he's like, Madam, your bag is heavy. Ho raha hai. आप इतने बोतल नहीं कैरी कर सकते इसमें 
so i keep putting this imagine this going in my bag so he is always he's just like please reduce either reduce other things so i can carry this comfortably i'm that person i'll keep reapplying i'm that person I'll wash my face reapply what is a comfort food and what is a comfort drink comfort food will be i love pav bhaji i love uh, safe puri uh, comfort drink will be chai and coffee i love there are times i want to drink chai there are times i want to drink but i'm a coffee drink. with 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 milk I, i have to drink almond milk because i am lactose intolerant so i have to choose almond milk an actor in hollywood and an actor in bollywood that you admire and why meryl streep in hollywood in india love rekha ji like she's someone who's just timeless She's way ahead over times when she was when she, in her age. Favorite ages. movie, Murad Jan. It just haunts me even now. I love, I love. I can revisit it as many times as I could. I love the commercial you shot for Shishiro. It's just so beautiful. Thank you. It's classy. Do you get very involved in your commercials when with the brand? Do you look? Do you discuss the look? Yeah. The branding, everything, or are you? I'm just going to come, do my shoot, and go. For this product in particular, I'm asking. I think for this, uh, for this advanced cream that we wanted. the main thing that we wanted to kind of showcase with this particular product is that it's one product that actually tackles most of your skin care issues fastest it's the easiest way to do it for people who don't have that kind of time and energy to invest in a long process um but the idea was also to show that normally it's only in festivities or in wedding seasons do people wake up and be like ha abhi skin care use karna hai which tends to happen but actually it needs to start much earlier true so the idea was to kind of put it into light that in in india it's only like festivities and wedding season when people kind of wake up and want to do something about their skin and they don't know what to do so this is a great way to kind of start off and then continue what do you think of the shishiro store in malaysia it is i am yet to visit it actually but i believe it's insanely huge and it's spectacular It's just amazing to see um, Sishiro. Lovely, they put up all these me. pictures as soon as you enter the mall. Yeah. It's like welcome to Manhattan. Uh, Sishiro is beautiful. Yeah, it's it's stunning. I love shooting their campaigns because they're very tastefully shot, and um, yeah, it it just feels like uh, they as a brand also have their heart and head in place for what they are trying to they try to sell, and I think that shows. You like. Uh, touch and feel shopping at stores as well as uh, uh, website shopping are you more online and more touch and feel i think my first time shopping i prefer touch and feel but like i because i say i know these products so then i don't mind shopping it online because i know how it's going to play out but when i'm shopping for the first time i don't mind touch and feel what's your year looking like what are you going to film now all your fans are so excited i am shooting at the moment actually i'm shooting for a show uh called partners it's for prime video lovely so it's going on but i'm not i'm 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 really enjoying this phase where the shooting is hectic no complaints <laughs> your favorite singer internationally and your favorite singer in india i love arijit so yeah, good it's just so good have any international favorite really i also love diljit he's really knocking it out of the park wherever he's going he's selling out arenas and stadiums yeah but i think he's it's long due actually yeah. class this is like totally. now he's getting his due but i think he was always very cool and he was always very good at what he did are you a taylor swift fan i actually am not so exposed to her music to be honest i know she's doing fantastic work but i'm just not i have haven't got into hearing her songs so i actually i don't know so now from all of us we wish you lots of love thank you for most importantly giving me some skin care advice yes and best of luck for your association with shadow and everything that you do this thank was lovely you. Thank, thank you thank you so much thank you 94.3 radio 1